In Music Library Tools, you can update just the genres for your MP3 tracks in your music library. I'm gonna be demonstrating this in Serato DJ Pro, but it's gonna be the exact same in all the other DJ softwares. So if you have a look at our music library right now, we haven't got any genres for our tracks. So to populate the genres, all you need to do is come over to Music Library Tools and click Populate Genre. It will come up with a pop-up saying, do you want to run Populate Genre? Click yes. And now it's going to ask you to select the folder. Here you'll select the folder where all your music lives on your computer. So all my music lives inside this all music folder. So I'm going to click this and click open. So all you need to do now is click Populate Genre again and then click yes. So what this will do, it will scan Spotify and get the genres for your MP3 tracks. Once this is finished, it's going to come up with a success message telling you exactly how long it's taken. So if you click OK here and then come back over to your DJ software, if you click Files at the top of Serato and then come over to Rescan ID3 tags, you can start to see that all these tracks get updated with the correct genre. Here are a few things to note about Populate Genre. If your track has no artist, it will not be scanned. If Spotify cannot find the genre for the specific track, it will search the genre associated with the artist and update the genre. If the track cannot be found, the genre will be populated with no genre. If the genre column already has a genre inside it, it will be skipped and will not be overwritten. If the genre column has no genre inside it, it will be scanned. If the genre column is blank, it will be scanned. Due to the data coming from Spotify, I have no control if a song cannot be found. Music Library Tools is here to help you organize your music library, so I really hope that Populate Genre can help you get organized.